And then the market said, get good, scrub. Hey guys, this is Andrew from Cryptomaton and I have an exciting new update for my cryptocurrency trading bot that I've been working on for the past month. So if you're new to this channel, um, I've been working on a cryptocurrency trading algorithm that it's supposed to place orders on new coins the moment that they are being listed on Binance. Now, just a quick breakdown of how that's been going historically. We've moved from detection speed 20 seconds down to 0.1 seconds, which means that the algorithm would be able to place a buy order within one second of a new coin being listed on Binance. Now, even with that speed, that proved to be not profitable enough or rather not profitable at all. And I've moved to sell orders instead. So instead of buying, when a new coin gets listed, I would get the algorithm to sell instead. Now in test mode, this proved to be very, very profitable. It actually made 12% profit on a stable coin new listing, and then it made over 50% profit on GALA, a new actual coin listing. Uh, so that's all well and good in test mode. The problem is that in order to put this in practice and to run it on the live network of uh, Binance and to place live trades, well, most coins are not being listed on margin or features orders the moment that they are being listed. They're only listed on the spot network. So unless you actually own that particular coin, you will not be able to place a sell order. Right, so this is where my new algorithm comes into place and I'm really excited to share it with you guys. Oh, by the way, um, if you want to try this out yourself, I will leave the GitHub links as well as a step-by-step -step guide in the description below, so make sure to check those out. If that sounds good to you guys, please subscribe to my channel, I really appreciate it. Uh, it makes me want to make more of these videos uh, and share it with you guys. Okay, let's jump into it. So naturally, in order to be able to take advantage of this uh, immediate sell action that the bot can perform, we have to pre-own this new coin. Now luckily Binance is telling us on its announcement page that they will be listing a new coin. So we can know um, usually about a day or two in advance that a new coin will be listed um, on the Binance spot network. So, in order to take advantage of this, I decided to build two new additions into the existing bot, uh, two new scripts. One of them will scrape the Binance listing page and the other one will send us a email notification once a new coin has been detected as an announcement on this uh, Binance announcement page. Right, so uh, this is a bit of a demo of the um, actual scrape part of the algorithm. Uh, so we're going to uh, Binance.com EN support Binance announcement. This is the page where Binance announces new coin listings. Um, and then we're looking for the top element, like the first link uh, that Binance will, uh, will put on their page. That's usually the last announcement. Uh, so we get that and then um, I've added a bit of logic into the script in order to um, only get the symbol. So I don't want the whole string Binance will list this and that. We only want to get the symbol and then we will use an additional script that will in fact send us an email notification. So let me show you that as well. All right, so once we've detected a new announcement from Binance, it's time to uh, let ourselves know that a new coin uh, will be listed um, at some point in the future. So the, I came up with the following script. It's actually quite simple, yet it works perfectly. Um, it's using the SMTP and SSL libraries in order to send ourselves an email notification. Uh, so uh, you can see that we have the subject line, Binance will list template literal coin, um, deposit some funds to be able to short it when listed. Uh, and then I've also included a um, the link to the Binance listing page if you want more information about this listing um, or um, a Google search about the token. You can see there. Um, if you want to find out more about it and where to buy. So at this moment, um, I don't have a particular exchange in mind, so I guess that would be also we would differ widely uh, from coin to coin. So um, I was considering maybe pancake swap would be the place to go. Uh, but then at the same time, yeah, it could be anything. So um, I've included a Google search so that you can find out where you can buy this before um, Binance will actually list the coin. Yeah, and send yourself an email and then this is what you're going to see. So as you'd expect, nothing fancy, uh, but it does work. 
So uh, well, obviously instead of none here, it will actually say the name of the coin. Uh, this is just due to my testing. Uh, so Binance will list the coin, deposit some funds, be able to short it when listed. You also have the URLs pulling through and they are clickable. So you can just click through and find out where you can buy that coin. So I guess you're kind of figuring out where I'm going with this at the moment, with this strategy. So the idea is that, well, you run this bot and you get notified that a new coin will be listed. Um, you get an email, you find out where to uh, buy that coin. You will have to buy that coin yourself manually and then you deposit it into your Binance wallet. And once you've done that, that, that's all you need to do. The algorithm will take care of the rest. The algorithm will sell at the optimum time. You don't have to deal with any of that, but you do have to buy the coin manually. Now I do have something in mind for um, automating this strategy. Okay, so let's break down the process of this algorithm and how you can actually use the bot yourself once again. Well, the algorithm places sell orders. But in order for you to be able to place sell orders on the Binance uh, spot network, you need to own the coin. Since Binance does not usually place new coin listings in margin or feature sell. Well, in order for you to own the coin, you need to buy the coin. And because it's not listed on Binance, you cannot buy it on Binance. You need to buy it from somewhere external. Now, this is where um, the code that I showed you before comes into play. Uh, it detects the announcement and it tells you that it's available uh, to be deposited into the Binance wallet. Now, where you buy this coin is up to you. Um, to be honest, I still have to find out a good way of doing this and testing it properly. Um, so I will keep you posted with that. In an ideal case scenario, we would actually have a process where this entire operation happens automatically, which is something that I am looking into that I'm hoping to explore within the next few weeks. Uh, just to give you guys a bit of a hint here, um, it has to do with interacting with the Binance Smart Chain. Uh, so for those of you that don't know, the Binance Smart Chain is Binance own a blockchain. So, well, the difference between the Binance Smart Chain and the Ethereum blockchain, for example, is that Binance's Smart Chain is uh, centralized. But because of that, it also has smaller fees. Anyway, that's not the point. So the point is to interact with the Binance Smart Chain in order to get access to the PancakeSwap smart contract. Um, again, for those that don't know, PancakeSwap is a decentralized exchange service where you can swap pretty much any token for any other token and is being hosted on the Binance Smart Chain. Now, my thinking goes that, well, chances are that those new coins that will get listed on Binance will actually be available for swap on the uh, PancakeSwap exchange. If you like this project, please subscribe to my channel for more and feel free to follow me on Twitter at CryptomatonBlog or shoot me a question on Reddit at CyberpunkMetalhead. Um, alternatively, if you have any ideas of what you would like to see next, please, as I said, leave it in the comments below, guys, and I will make sure to read that and, uh, yeah, try and make it happen. Take care.